Thank you, Jamie. It's five o'clock somewhere and I'm about to get off work. You mind if I come see how that bourbon festival is starting a little early? Oh my gosh, come on, Ty. We have some items for you to come on out and try. And really St. Louis can get on out here and try as they are getting ready for the third annual bourbon festival. It's happening Friday, October 6th. And we have two fellas here who know bourbon very well. We have Joe and Drew. And Drew, you were telling me that this is something that you guys love doing. Yes. How cool is it to be able to invite the community out with live music, live performances, so many tastings, 100 plus vendors. It's a time. It really is. Yeah, it, it's a great time to have the have the Bourbon community come together for some fellowship, and also enjoy the Benton Park neighborhood. And it's it's fall, so it's kind of the uh, the quintessential kind of Lemp Mansion, Cherokee Street, Ooh. Demino. Ghosts maybe might be there. Who knows? Spooky season. Yeah, it's, it's a great time. <laughs> well, if you're a little scared, you know, just just take a shot of bourbon. You'll be fine. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and you are here today with us, Hard Truth Distillery. I mean, you made a couple of drinks for us, but you also brought in some fall flavors. Yep. People can actually kind of sample those at the bourbon festival. Yeah, that for sure. I always bring uh, our flavored goodies with us. Anytime we can taste people, we, we definitely do, um, including our toasted coconut rum. This is the top selling item we make. You've never tasted coconut rum that tastes like this. Okay, well, I can't wait to taste <laughs> it. I love coconut anything, so why not, you know, make some rum out of it, right? Absolutely. Okay, we'll take it. Alrighty, St. Louis, you can go ahead and purchase those tickets. It is happening Friday, October 6th. It is the third annual St. Louis Bourbon Festival, 6 p.m. to 9 p.m. It's gonna be live music, live entertainment, lots of tastings, 100 plus vendors. A portion of ticket sales do benefit the St. Louis Hero Network for first responders. And we'll make sure you have access to all of that information on our website at studiostl.tv.